Okay, basically, two teams got stuck in this abandoned ghost town, and one hour a nuclear bomb's gonna hit, so they gotta, like, escape. I don't know how they got in there. They're kind of stupid. But, uh, yeah, let's see which team escapes. I honestly don't know. They're both kind of idiots to even get in here. But, uh, yeah, let's start with Team A. <laughs> You have one hour to escape! God, I swear, sometimes they just scream for no reason. It's so weird. Okay, they literally guessed the first clue. They even said where they had to go next! Target's oh, in here, you can shoot wait, them. But then they just, like, looked around the map instead for some reason. After wasting like 10 hours trying to look around, they finally figured out, oh, we should probably do what we said we should do at the start. Oh, wait a minute. What, what are they doing? Wait. Uh, oh, oh, okay. Never mind. They, they didn't make progress. They went back to looking around. Okay. Uh, is this ever going to finish? Oh my god. They literally spent like 10 minutes deciding what to do. Okay, no. Like, realistically, they spent an entire minute to figure out, oh, Let's shoot the bow at the targets! Once they did that, they got the key to the city and a thing that told them to go buy milk. Yeah. And after waiting another 20 seconds, they used their smart brains to put the key to the city in the hole that said, Key to the City. Great job! You just unlocked the grocery store! Anyway, they followed the instructions and got milk. And then they also robbed the store of one dollar. Like, what the heck? Why would they do that? Oh, what the heck? After swiftly running away from their crime scene, they then used the dollar bill to open up the hotel. After going inside of the hotel room, they used the milk to clear up their blindness that they got after entering the hotel room. And then, after using their smart brains to walk across the pressure place that gave them blindness ten times, they proceeded to break a painting. After stumbling along a bit longer and drinking a lot of milk, they finally found the sheriff's key. Wow, good job. Then, they used their big brains to figure out, let's put the sheriff's key in the sheriff's office. And wowee, it opened the door. Now, after entering the office, they went into the bunker, without thinking twice. Then they decided, let's read all the signs, which led them to believe we should crouch into the painting. Of course, it worked. And once they got inside, they flicked the lever, which opened up the bunker. <laughs> Then, once they all arrived in the finish area, they finished with a grand time of 5 minutes and 2 seconds. Let's see if the other team will beat them. You guys start in 3, 2, 1, GO! I feel like the barrels in the bar was a little bit too obvious because they too also found it first thing. But they too also spent like 10 minutes trying to figure out, oh, because they spell bank, we should probably go to the bank. Yeah, so they finally shot the arrows at the thingies and got the key to the city and then started progressing with the map. And hey, they did it faster than the other team, so yay. Okay, I don't know what it is with these teams and committing crimes, but they did the exact same thing as the other team and stole the money from the store and then proceeded to rob the milk and then run away from it. Like, what the heck? Do laws not apply to you now? Okay, after committing a crime, and then they used the stolen money to get a hotel room, and then ransacked the hotel room to find a lost key. Like, are these people sane? What the heck? Thank <laughs> you.
Oh, a sheriff's key. Oh, Great, they found the key. So now they're heading over to the sheriff's office to then break into a sheriff's office and into their private office. Like, these guys have no regard for the law, I swear. In less than 10 seconds, they discovered he's supposed to crouch through the painting in which they turned on the lever and, uh, and finished the map. And boom, these are the finished times on screen. And yes, there actually was a prize for whoever finishes first. And that prize just so happens to be, they get to choose my next video that I upload. Oh boy, what are they gonna choose? Anyway, Team B won. Uh, yeah, I was surprised either of them escaped, but they did. So, yeah. I guess see you in the next video.